But hey, what up, folks? I'm gonna do a little bit of a couple of things today. I, I wanted to talk with y'all about some some things that I saw that were pretty interesting. And I need to get this Fire Knight's Great Sword <laughs> on uh on Elden Ring because I. I didn't know where to get it and i recently found out that i just ran past the dude a few times so i'm gonna go bonk him up upside the head and see how long it'll take me to get it i have my arcane sucks but we're gonna see how i go but there was a couple of things first that i wanted to go over and one of the first things was uh snk versus capcom they brought that one back and i wanted to look at the trailer so we're gonna look at the trailer um so good morning how y'all doing all that good stuff? But well, we're gonna watch this real quick. Okay, real quick, I'm seeing this and I've seen people talk about it, but I almost thought that they were doing something different with it. I almost thought that it was like, I didn't pay attention. That's on me. That's on me. I didn't pay attention. I almost thought it was something different. So I was like, okay, is it the same thing or did they upgrade the graphics? Did they do anything different? But so far, I'm not seeing anything different. Now I'll, I'll let it finish. Okay, I gotta look at this next one. What? Where did he go? No, I haven't watched. I haven't seen this one. I'm keeping up with Mark of the Wolves. Mark of the Wolves was one of my favorite ones. But back to uh, SVZ Chaos. That's a that's a that's an interesting choice for a game to bring back. So I remember back early 2000s. That game came out. Capcom versus SNK one, good. Capcom versus SNK, SNK two was amazing. That was one of the ones. Capcom versus SNK two, one of the ones where I really found out that I was like, yo. I really am Bison's character. That was the one that really, I really learned how to play with him Bison and understood that I can play with him with more of a poking style and I can get in and out, use my throws and everything to be a threat up front and then use his kicks and everything, but then use his head stomps, the cycle crusher and everything to poke people and to wake up all that stuff recently seen video of a person talking about how Zangief does. Let me come back to that. <laughs> seeing svc chaos come back like i see people talking about it coming back but i'm like this game it wasn't the worst but it was weird it was a weird game and maybe it'll reach a new audience now i want them to come back and i want it to do well as always i talk a lot of mess about everything it's just what i do when it comes to like <laughs> certain companies and corporations and stuff it's like, because it, the way it, it works in my head is like, there's a point, right? There's like underdog, you're there, then you're big. And then once you get to a certain point, you have all the assets, the analytics, the research to know what works. You know what works once you get there. And if you choose to not do that, then I'm like, okay, you have all the researchers, you have all the groups, you have all this stuff that you know works and you're choosing to do something else. Now, artistically, I ain't mad at that. But if it's something that folks ain't really asking you for and you going off doing some other stuff, it's like, uh, what's really going on, right? That's how it usually goes in my head. That's how when you hear me talk about Marvel, all this other stuff, that's that's where it's usually coming from. Because you guys have access to what works. You know what works. And so even with this game, I kind of, I, I remember they were saying there was some behind the scenes stuff going on. 
but like some of the characters in the fight system was a little strange the story was just all over the place but that's like snk game that's most fighting games but snk games man it is be all over the place so this one is an interesting choice and i want to see how people are going to react to it me personally i would want it to do well so that we could see a new game come out maybe and they can kind of fix what they messed up on but if it's a thing where it's just roll out of this one and it's just kind of like eh, it's like eh, okay I'll, I'll play it here and there because even my me and my friends we played it a little bit but it was like nah we're going back to capcom versus snk2 chaos was always just there and even in the arcades because that's where i come from <laughs> um even the arcades we go in and be like oh yeah so seeing it and see people be like yeah i was like uh do y'all not remember this game it wasn't it wasn't that great it wasn't the worst thing ever the character choice is a little weird the systems were strange <laughs> And so some of the stuff they went decided to go with was like, really? But the main thing that I remember from it is Ken. I remember like the Violet Ken character. I was always glad that they made one. That Ken got that shine. And I thought that Street Fighter would have went that way with Street Fighter VI, but they decided to make him a bum <laughs> with beat up Timberlands. He's not a bum. I know, I know he's not a bum, but they decided to make him a bum. And I was like, yo, why didn't they just go the route where he w was the one that became the violent, rageful one? After everything he went to, and maybe maybe they'll do it in another one. I don't know. I'm not about to do all, I'm not about to go too far into that. But it was just interesting. Re-releasing this one, I want to see how it'll work. I hope it does well. So hopefully it'll lead to some other stuff, other games being made. But that was uh, interesting. So I, I wanted to see this one, Fatal Fury City of the Wolves. Now I'm interested in this game too. Mark of the Wolves was cool. I played a lot of that on the Dreamcast. I really hope that this one comes out well. So I haven't watched this trailer or anything. So I wanted to, I wanted to go ahead and watch that. It's a bad day to be you. She like Ralph. Yeah. Like Ralph and them boys. This man just punch. Hopefully, <laughs> <laughs> SK ain't got no damn sense. <laughs> He's like Ralph and Clark. I believe it was Clark name, right? Ralph and Clark. I forget their names. I never played with them. I like. I found out later on what they were doing. I was like, oh, okay. They they story sound interesting. Um, all right, but I didn't. I never really played with uh Ralph and Clark and all them. So they were never really the ones that I was really up on. But we're gonna see. Me, I'm personally waiting for Terry and Rock. Like on this new Fatal Fury. Those are the two that I really want to play with. Now, if they bring some of Taekwondo, uh, Kim Kapwan's uh, sons back, I'd like to see what they were up to. What was it Kim Kim Jae-hoon and Kim Jong Wong? Them them two. If they bring them two back, I want to see what them two were up to. But um, we'll see, we'll see. I don't I don't have a, a yay or nay on it yet. So I, 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 wanna, I wanna try it out and see what it's about and we'll go from there. 